a new temperature scale. You propose a new temperature scale with temperatures given in degrees M. You define 0.0, .0 degrees M to be the normal melting point of mercury and 100.0 degrees M to be the normal boiling point of mercury. Part A, what is the normal boiling point of water in degrees M? Part B, a temperature change of 10.0 degrees M corresponds to how many degrees Celsius? Okay, so in order to answer this question, we need to look up the normal uh, melting point of mercury. You can find this on the internet. The normal melting point of mercury is minus 38.83 degrees Celsius, which is approximately minus 39 degrees Celsius if we use uh, two significant figures. Uh, the normal boiling point of mercury is the other calibration point uh, for this new temperature scale. The normal boiling point of uh, mercury is 356.7 degrees Celsius. So uh, we can note this to be 357 degrees Celsius approximately. So if we have a temperature in the new scale, M scale, of 0.0, .0 degrees M, this corresponds to, in the Celsius scale, minus 39 degrees Celsius. If we have 100.0 degrees M, that corresponds to 357 degrees Celsius. If we talk about a change of temperature in the M scale, the new scale, uh, of 100 degrees M, 100 minus 0, this corresponds to a temperature change in the Celsius scale, 357 minus minus 39, so plus 39, of 396 degrees Celsius. All right, so uh, this tells us that a change of temperature in the M scale, delta Tm, is 100 divided by 396 times a temperature change in the Celsius scale. So that if the temperature of the a Celsius scale changes by 396, you can see here, this will give us 100 for delta Tm. Or if we can simplify this, delta Tm, we will find to be, if you divide it top and bottom by 4, 25 over 99 delta Tc. So this is what we get uh, for the temperature change between a conversion between Celsius and the new temperature scale, uh, M scale. Okay, that's the new temperature scale we have defined. So you can see that the conversion between M scale and Celsius scale will be Tm equals 25 over 99 Tc plus a constant x, which is to be determined. Now, 0 degrees M corresponds to minus 39 degrees Celsius. So 25 over 39, uh, 25 over 99, minus 39 degrees Celsius plus X. So this gives us for X, 975 divided by 99. All right. So this gives us, uh, for Tm, the conversion between Celsius and M scale, 25 over 99 Tc plus 975 divided by 99. 
So this is the conversion we find between the Celsius scale and the newly defined temperature scale, the M scale. All right. So uh, one thing I would like to do is to check uh, 100 degrees M. So you can check uh, is 100 degrees M equal to 25 over 99 times 357 plus 975 over 99. Uh, if you perform this calculation, you will see that this is correct. So uh, when Tc is equal to 100 degrees C, that's the normal boiling point of water, that's what we're trying to find in, in the M scale, normal boiling point of water. Uh, this corresponds to a temperature in the new scale, 25 divided by 99 times 100 plus 975 divided by 99. And that gives us this calculation gives us for the temperature of boiling uh, water as 35.1 degrees M. All right. And in part B, uh, we want to know a temperature change of 10 degrees M corresponds to how many degrees Celsius. Uh, if we use the uh, temperature change uh, conversion here, delta Tm of 10.0 degrees M is 25 divided by 99 delta Tc. So we can pull out delta Tc as 39.6 degrees Celsius. Okay. So this was a good exercise to find the conversion, the expression for conversion between two temperature scales. We have an M scale, uh, which was defined by the normal melting point of mercury, zero degrees M, and normal boiling point of mercury, 100 degrees M, which are actually in the Celsius scale, minus 39 degrees Celsius and 357 degrees Celsius, respectively. So we want to know one, what is the corresponding temperature in M scale of normal boiling point of water, which is 100 degrees Celsius. So we wrote the temperatures 0 and 100 corresponding to minus 39 degrees C and 357 degrees C. We see a delta Tm of 100 corresponds to a delta Tc of 396. This allows us to obtain delta Tm in, in terms of delta Tc. And it tells you that there is a linear relationship between Tc and Tm. Tm is 25 over 99 Tc plus a constant. And that constant can be determined by using one of these relationships. When Tc is minus 39, Tm should be 0. So that gives us x. We can check if this works at 100 when Tc is 357. 357 times 25 over 99 plus the value of x we have determined is 100. So this conversion works. So the question was, what is the corresponding temperature for 100 degrees C? So if we substitute 100 here, we obtain 35.1 degree M. And what is the corresponding Celsius uh, scale temperature change if the M scale temperature change is 10? Here we can use this conversion expression. Delta Tc would be then 99 times 10 over 25, 39.6 degree Celsius.